Welcome back guys to episode 217. <clears throat> so yeah, basically in the last introduction I didn't say the number correctly, so shameful, shame to me. So, I'm Miss Kitty 2K and let's get started. Oh, this is summertime saga, I can do it. Hey Maria. Hmm? Oh hey there Miss Kitty, what can I do for ya? Um, you and Tony, about Tony. What about us? How did you end up together? Hey, we ended up together because Tony wouldn't make take no fa for no answer. You told him no? Not me. My father. He hated Tony till the he day he died. How come? Well, it's complicated. Let's just say that Tony used to be associated with an unsavory element. I don't understand. Ah, uh, that's probably for the best. You liked him though. Of course, I fell in love with Tony Mon the moment I met him. He was the quintessential bad boy. Oh, I was always a sucker for the bad boys. Don't get me wrong, Tony was sweet too, a real romantic, and he did everything he could to get my, my father's good graces, even after the son of a bitch disowned me. Your father disowned you? Yeah. He told me if I married Tony, he would never speak to me again. Holy crap. So you just never spoke with him again? Now we made up 12 years later. 12 years? You guys didn't talk for 12 years? Heh, <laughs> he was a stubborn old bastard. No doubt. It hurt going through that, but I still had my ma and my friends. And I had Tony. So I don't regret nothing. That's beautiful. Hey, I don't know why I'm telling you all this. Sorry, I shouldn't have asked. No, it's alright. You're just easy to open up, I guess. Weird. Oh, okay, so I think, you know, it was just to talk a bit with her. It was cute, you know. What about this? Here. I guess there is really nothing to check. Because I'm still looking around to see if I can find a, you know, a hidden achievement. But actually, no. It seems like I'm not gonna find it. Yeah. So, what am I going to do? Okay, find a cold towel for the yen. Yeah, apparently I kind of left her there. <laughs> so, okay, oh, what? Okay, one glass of water coming up. No one working in the garden today. I'll have to come back another time. Okay. So should I again deliver some pizzas? Okay, I'll well just stop the the video here for a second. So here we are again at home. <laughs> okay. I just want to see if there is still the yeah. The drawing Evie made me. It's amazing, really. This is Bonnie and Clyde. I guess there is nothing else in the room I can actually see. So let's go out of this. Okay. She's still there. Okay, bits, bits of transportation is a precise business. <coughs> I hope I don't have to deliver more of them again, because, my god, please, no. Hey there, champ. You ready to deliver some pizza? I would like to make him talk a bit, like Italian Mafia. What do you know about the Italian Mafia? Eh, <laughs> Maria warned me she spilled the beans on that. So, it's true then? Yeah, it's true. How did you get mixed up with the mob, Tony? Well, it's not like there was a whole lot of opportunities out there for an orphan boy with no education. After the orphanage sent us packing, we were forced to do whatever we could to keep a roof over our heads and food in our belly. It was only a matter of time until we fell into crime. So what do you want to know? Uh, I would like to know about the tattoo. So, about the tattoo. How that? <laughs> it's the Trinacria, champ. A Sicilian sunburn that's older than dirt. Lots of the mob guys do it. I see. How did you join? 
Oh, that was Luigi's doing. He used to ride at subway bath and forth, back and forth, pickpocketing folks. And one day he got caught with his hand in Lorenzo Rossi's pocket. Who's Lorenzo Rossi? He was a bookie for the mob boss. Oh. Yeah, Luigi thought he was a dead man, for sure. But then he got up, the guy up and offers him a job instead. Really? Yep. Luigi decided he'd rather be an employee than a dead man, so he took it. Makes sense. Well, a few weeks later, he brought me into the fort. Just like that? Yeah, more or less. I had to prove I could handle myself first, but you know me. That wasn't the problem. So you didn't have any reservations about joining a gap? Oh, I had tons of them. But then you get a glimpse of how lucrative organized crime can be and your reservation fly right out of the window. Know what I mean? I knew it was my chance to carve out something nice for Maria and myself. Make a decent fi life for us and ours, you know. Oh, I feel so sorry for him. Have you killed people? Sheesh, you're just diving it into right, right into it, huh? You know, the mafia's business isn't about killing people, champ. It's more about extorting them. They want money, no blood. Violence is just a byproduct. So, is that a yes? <sighs> Kid, I did what I had to survive. It was ugly business and I've been party to some real awfulness. Things I've gonna live with for the last of my days. Things you might think you wanna know about, but trust me, champ, you don't. Can you understand what I'm saying? Y yeah, I guess. Good, cause I really don't wanna go into that stuff with you now. Uh, why did you quit? That's enough. I mean, that's enough. It's not. Uh, Italian mafia order pizza. You bet. How about the Russians? Quickly. What about them? I'm curious how you know them. Uh, that's a long story, champ. Let's just say I've had dealings with them in the past, okay? Alright. You mentioned someone named Raz. Who is he? Raz is their boss. How does that work? What do you mean? I mean, since we, when do criminals have bosses? They're Bratva, kid. Bratva? Russian Mafia. Surely you know what Mafia is, don't you? Yeah, I think so. What are the Russian Mafia doing in Somerville? Pfft, how I know? But whatever they're doing, it ain't good. I'll tell you that for free. You'd be wise to steer to well clear of them. I should go. So, basically, yes, we got some informations more. Not that they are essential, but still, you know. I'll just do this quickly once more, and then I'll from last from next time I will just try to skip them in a game because I mean at least not to show you because it's boring for you at least. So I hope you enjoyed this episode and see you in my next one. I love you so much.